Today I'm making butternut squash puree. To start, you'll need a butternut squash. Have the squash and remove the seeds. Then place it onto a lined baking sheet and bake for about an hour at 325 Fahrenheit or 160 Celsius, cut side down. I flip these ones over before I pop them in the oven. The squash is done once it's super soft and a fork pierces the squash with ease. At this point, you can use a spoon to scrape out the soft inner part of the squash, or place a rack over a bowl and squish the squash through. The skin will peel off easily afterwards. Place your squash into a blender and then add in enough cream just to get the mix going easily in the blender. Add in the cream in small additions so that the puree doesn't get too watery. Once it's reached the consistency that you're looking for, Add in a little bit of salt and some butter and then blend on high. This will emulsify the puree and the butter will make the mixture glossy, giving it a beautiful shine on plates. If you have a blender where you can pour things in the top, it's better, but currently I'm not home and I have to use what I have access to, so any type of blender works fine. You can flavor the puree with whatever you like, but this goes really well with sage and you can serve it along anything that goes well with squash, like winter veg, walnuts, pork, apples, pecans, pears, etc. If you like this video, consider subscribing and feel free to connect with me on Instagram at chefstudio underscore. Thanks for watching.